Hey guys. Oh gosh. I'm looking for my keys because today we are talking about the three keys to soft slapping. Stay tuned if you need some tips on your soft slap. So key number one, you have all heard it before, keep your hands inside the ball. I know that you've heard this so many from so many coaches, myself included, but it's so important. So if I'm going to soft slap, it's gonna be super important that my path to the ball, I am actually physically keeping my hands inside the ball, okay? So if I have my hands away from the ball or away from my body, I don't really have much control over the bat. So that's gonna be super important is making sure that I keep my hands inside the ball. So this is a fun drill. If you get two tees, put two balls on there, you're gonna hit that first ball, but you're gonna know right away if you're doing this right or wrong, because if I hit this back ball, that means I'm having my hands cast out. But if I'm hitting this first ball, that means I'm keeping my hands inside the ball. Let's give it a go. So key number two is making sure that your bat barrel is parallel where you want to go. So if I want to go left side, I want to go to shortstop, my bat barrel at contact is going to be parallel to shortstop. If I want my ball to go to second base, I got to get out in front a little bit more, but I want my bat barrel to be parallel to second base. So that is what is so important about a soft slap is me being in control. So I'm going to dictate where I want this ball to go. The last and final key is your tempo through the box. It's gonna be super important, especially on the soft slap, that I pick up speed. The most common mistake on a soft slap or any type of slap is that I'm making contact and having to pick up speed again to try to get to first base. So on a soft slap, I want to touch and go. So it's gonna be super important that I pick up speed as I go through the box. So to recap, the three keys to a soft slap. The key number one, keep your hands inside the ball. I know you guys have heard this a ton, but it's super important. Keep your hands inside the ball because that's going to allow me to have good back control. Key number two is as a slap hitter, I dictate where I'm putting this ball. So where my bat barrel makes contact, if I took a picture of you, I want my bat barrel to be parallel to shortstop. If I'm going five, six, it's going to be parallel to second base if I'm taking the ball with me. Super simple, you are in control. The last and final key is your tempo through the batter's box. As a slap hitter, and especially on my soft slap, I want to pick up speed. More common than not, a lot of soft slap hitters are trying to make contact, be so perfect, and then pick up speed. If anything, you wanna be continuous through that box and be in control. You guys got this. I can't wait to hear how this goes for you. Leave a comment below so I know how your soft slaps are going. Like this video if you liked it. Subscribe above so that you can see all of my videos every single week. I'll see you next time. Bye.